The San Francisco Zoo's campaigning to end the ivory trade. KCBS's Margie Schaefer reports people are being encouraged to take an anti-ivory pledge. An estimated 100 elephants are poached every day, and director of the San Francisco Zoo, Tanya Peterson, is concerned. Today is World Elephant Day, and we thought we'd take this opportunity to educate our visitors and the community about the illegal ivory trade. And what we hope to do is encourage folks to not buy new ivory. The push comes even as there are no elephants at the San Francisco Zoo. Zoo. Rhinos are on display, which are also targeted for their horns. The price of ivory has tripled in China since 2010, says zoo supporter John McNellis. We cannot point fingers here in San Francisco as we are the second largest market for selling ivory in the United States. Supervisor Norman Yi grew up in Chinatown and didn't think twice about ivory carvings, which are valued for luck and as an art form. Now he knows that animals are being killed. I want to get the word out because it's, it's really about the next generation that will be aware of this issue. An anti-ivory pledge can be found online at sfzoo.org. Margie Schaefer, KCBS.